What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to the internet. I'm your host, Frankel, and this is Michael. All right, so today we're doing a stipulation draft. It says if you draw a card... It, oh, oh, Josh VS stipulation. If it says draw a card on it, you have to draft it. In cases where there are more than one with the text, prioritize the blue card. Okay. It's 10.07 where I'm at. This is weird. Wait. Oh, my God, that is weird because you're, you're on the East Coast. Um, okay. Whoa. Whoa. This says draw a card, but so does this and this technically. Are we going by the spirit of the... Yeah, the prioritize is the blue card. Mm. But but this doesn't technically say draw a card, right? It just puts a card in your hand. Uh, we should have consulted the stip master. That's yeah, hard. It's hard to do. Stuff like this. I'm like in the same time. That is true, Chris. Chris, if you go south a little bit, you can probably just meet us. Just a little bit. Because I don't like Brainstorm, but I do like Seagate Oracle. So what do? I mean, he basically draws you a card. You're putting a card in your hand that wouldn't be there otherwise. All right. Well, I w all right. All right. This also, same thing. Like, Dark Confidant draws you a card. Elvish Visionary says draw a card on it. I'm in Massachusetts. I'd have to go south. Yeah, but you're just making excuses now. I think you just do it. Spiritual Blue Card. What are you, you're a spiritual blue card. Got him. Dang. Got him. I think we have to take the Elvis version there here. I think you're right. Yeah, Chris, Shadows, let's go. Everybody come in. Come in. Come through. It's lit. This says draw a card on it, and I don't hate taking it. Solemn also says draw a card. True. But we have to prioritize the blue card. Oh, you're right. All right, blue card it is. Dang, that's an easy pick because it says right on there. The Empiric Tutor is kind of like draw a card. Right, but I think because none of there's no flat out draw card, I think we, we get can to pick whatever we want. The Urban Inspector gets you a a, cl a clue that says draw card in the rules text. <laughs> that's pretty bad. I really don't want to take that. I don't think we have to, right? It doesn't specifically say draw card on it. The card doesn't say draw a card. The rules text does, but I'm not sure if that counts. Card says draw a card, even if it's in there. Why do you? Why are you like this? All I had to do was not point it out. I thought we were friends. God. Well, I guess we have to take that then. I wish Joss was here to to confirm. I'm gonna take it because it's a stipulation. Preordain, draw a card. Also, this one says draw a card, so I think it depends on which one we want. Seeing that we're green, this might be... Might be good. It might be good because we can get, like, Arrogant Worm or Root Wall or something. Wow, friends don't let friends ruin stipulations. That's cold, man. What do you think? I think Compulsion is overall a better card. And I don't even know if that's true, actually. Scry 2 draw a card's pretty strong. We already have a Ponder, though. I don't know how many... I think, I think this is a more useful card. This might be a better card, but this is a longer... I'm going to try the compulsion. I've lost 32 pounds walking and watching your YouTube. Wow, that's pretty awesome. I should try that. I should walk and watch my own YouTube videos. 32 pounds is a pretty ridiculous amount, man. Compulsion says draw more card times than Ponder does. That's actually hard to deny. True. Chris, I like that you're in Massachusetts and you're still hanging out watching our, watching the watching the stream. I'm a fan. What up, Noah? You old drunk you? No draw, no draw, no draw. But I like this pack. I think it's actually pretty good. Trade one wider could be wider. Trade one wider could be good with Visionary and Thraben Inspector already in our in our deck. Misty Rainforest could also just be great. Chris, tell she Chris I said hi. What do you think? I think it's one of Misty's these two. Misty's pretty strong. What is Misty Rainforest? This guy's an engine, though, man. Return of permanence with their own hand. You just bounce it every single turn. It's true. Whatever. Too late. Ooh. Ooh. This says draw a card on it, boy. Sure does. This does, too, but you got to prioritize that blue one. I make dance. Thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back. Why you on so late? Nothing. I'm complaining. It's basically the only ray of light in my... Oh, my God. That's so sad. Rukia, basically, uh, I want to get as many iterations of the cube out of the way before it goes away tomorrow. 
Our deck is actually looking pretty good. And maybe that's just because all of our cards... Everything but three of an inspector. <laughs> Hater's gonna hate. Delicious fruit water. Yours? Yeah. What did you get? I didn't. I just wanted to say fruit water. Oh. You can, You want a little... You want a hit? You want a little hit of watermelon or tropical? Yeah, but let me save it for the refill. So okay, I so you get cup. the full... Yeah. Yeah, cube was only around for a week. Uh, usually when it's like player spotlight cubes, they only keep them around for one week, which is not something I'm a huge fan of. Hey, man, can I get a key bump of watermelon liquid? Yeah, man, I got you. I'll get you a key bump <laughs> for that watermelon. What is after this cube? Literally back to M19, I believe. Super exciting. Hmm, and these are all cards. Oh, Rogue Refiner draws a card. Yes, he does. I got excited because it's actually pretty good for us. Although, I don't think we'll do anything with energy. It's still a guy that says draw a card. He's a 2-2 two, two for 3. Not bad, not bad, not bad. And he's in our green-blue colors. Worst fruit to inf infuse water with. Um, I don't know. We're going to go out durian. Shape of Water. Chris, enjoy your Shape of Water. Did you say durian? Yeah. Did you only say it because it's like the worst fruit, period? Yeah, well, it's not the worst fruit, period, but it's pretty close. Period. What's the worst fruit, period, then? Uh, there's this other fruit. What's the name of it? Sorry, you're weird, tribal. It's called, like, Got ki Kiai something. It's some weird fruit that's, like, literally tastes like rotting flesh, apparently. I watch YouTube like videos on flesh. it, and people are throwing up. It's pretty great. I wonder if Blossoming Defense is good in this cube. Is it better than Wall of Reverence? I think so. Well, Too late. Anyway. Doesn't matter. Doesn't even matter. Oh, yeah. That's the Kool-Aid, man. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. Got her. Yeah, you should be offended. That's what happens when you get wrecked. Getting offended is the first stage of getting wrecked. Getting wrecked is the first stage. Getting offended is the second stage. I actually saw a photo of a banana infused with water. That seems really weird. I also said banana instead of banana. <laughs> banana. 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 Shit. Banana. Oh. Hard to spell banana, man. Oh my god, is this it? It looks really weird. Oh, that's bourbon. Ooh, that sounds delicious. No, dude. Just stop. Yeah, apparently it's all banana bourbon that I'm finding on the internet. I banana bourbon is freaking delicious. Bop, bop, ba da bop. Banana bourbon. Bop, 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 bop. See what you did there. I don't know what to take here. None of these cards are probably getting played by us. Planar Maybe Fearling cleansing. of Dread. What did you say? Planet Cleansing? Mm -hmm. This might be better. Because it looks like we could kind of be a tempo deck. Ooh, Kodama of the North Tree? That's got to be better than a Sanctum. Triple green, though. We're base green, bro. I guess. So. It'll be okay. We'll, we'll make it through. Choose a color of white creatures you control, gain protection from that color. That would be a lot better if it wasn't only white creatures. I agree with you. Oh, Void Slime came back? Wow, that's playable. That's main. Do you guys have a favorite alcoholic drink? I don't drink, so... Post something in chat so I can ban you. <laughs> I'm a big fan of flavored rums. Like strawberry rum. And tequila, apparently. Eh, not so much. But Mike goes it, real it hard on the job tequila. Done. It gets the job done. It gets the job done, it does. Mm-hmm, yes, yes, yes. Okay, this says draw a card on it. So does Remand. Uh, what else? This one, it says draw a card on it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's the only two. Okay, guess we got a good choice there. You ain't never gonna convince me to not take Cryptic Command, bro. You ain't never had a friend like me. You ain't never had a friend like me. Oh, I like Draining Wilk a lot. I also like birds in this deck, though. Do you like Dark and Stormies, Mike? I don't know what that is. What's my British government plan? Uh, obviously, every day is Chicken Sunday. Everybody knows that. Every day. Favorite pizza topping? Hmm. You know what you're going to say. It's just going to be some boring bullshit. I would say feta cheese. I like pepperonis. 
No, I like feta cheese. Pepperonis on my pizzas. And if I had the choice, salami is much better than pepperoni. In my Salam. Salami. None of these cards say draw a card, which is nice. Rum and ginger beer. No, it sounds delicious, though. I'd try it. Oh, Painful Truths does. Dang. The only card that says draw a card? As far as I can tell, I really want this Sylvan carry added, though. Yeah, but we got to take the one that says draw a card. Was there one last pack that's a draw card that wasn't wasn't in our color, maybe? I'm just worried I missed that last pack because I got kind of tunnel vision on the colors that we were in. All right, we're taking this. No, 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 no. I think it might just be circular logic, especially with uh, compulsion. Yeah, but that's the only thing we really have to discard. To. I mean, f for now. It could be Rishkar, but I'm not really like, super excited about Rishkar. Rishkar, Hogar. <laughs> But my courier draws cards in a red way. That's true. Make me draw some kind of way. I want to take this circular logic. It's still a counterspell. Even if you don't discard, it's still a counterspell, you friggin' nerd. Yeah, for one now, for three mana. Okay, so here's the thing. If there are no cards in here that draw you cards, which I don't think there are, we're going to take this and hope the donate comes back. Okay. You in for that? I'm in for that. Okay. Draw, draw. Nope, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, Wood Elves. Wood yeah, Elves is nice. That. That's real good. Any any uh, any future fetch lands that are green are great. Or uh, shock lands, rather. Or dual lands, for that matter. Well, we're halfway there, so... Living on a prayer. Take my hand. The illusions, I swear. Can we do a charm step? Like, only take charms? No, there's not enough charm for that. <laughs> Sorry, do you think there's like a charm in every pack? A charm in every pack. That's my British government plan. It's a good British government plan. Thank you. Got that triple blue, triple triple green. You know how we do. This is how we do it. <laughs> this is how we do it. Uh, oh. of Nature says draw a card. Oh, it does? And so does this guy, but I think this is probably better. Yeah. I can get behind that. I don't know if we're going to play it or not, but we got to take it. You can make a whole command deck with char... Can you really? There are no hundred charms. What's wrong with you? There's no way that's possible. Do you want to do that? Can you? Is there a hundred charms? There's 99 a charms. charms? I got 99 charms. <laughs> but... A charming... Let's just look up charms on... That's what I'm going to do. On Scryfall. I was going to look at MT, MTGO... Uh, oh, yeah, but it's, it's actually now Scryfall, so... 54 cards is the name that includes charm. That's a good amount. That's half of a commander deck. Who's your who's your leader? Reaper King? Wow, that's Who is your leader? My, my magic cards that info finally redirected to uh, Scryfall. Uh, which is probably for the best, because Scryfall is really, really nice. But it's so crispy and clean. It is, but like it's it's bittersweet, you know. Why? Because I really like magic cards and info. It's so I like magic cards and info because it was simple. So is this right? But I'm not used to it. Oh, Ramos is best for charms. They buff him. So there you go. Hmm. We were just talking about Ramos earlier. Ramos. You know Ramos. I do know Ramos. I do know Ramos. And Chronicler says draw cards as much as I want this you have my coast. Yep. Gotta take it. Come on. Donate. I'm really hoping it comes back. I don't know why anyone would take it if we, if we already got the illusions. Someone trying to screw over someone else. Oh, and if it isn't Frankie Cod, draw the point. Hey, Frank, have you seen the new DC animated movie, Death of Superman? I have not. Oh, a little Rudy Tootie. I'll take a Rudy Tootie. Although one of these, one of these blue black uh, black white lands can actually fix her with Painful Truths and Sphinx's Revelation, which is kind of funny. Then why don't we take that? I think we should. I'll be honest with you. Rudy Tootie is too cutie. <laughs> 
Do we have any other way to discard? We have Compulsion. That's it. I think it's still the right pick. I don't really want to go too deep into the black and white. I think we might have to, though. A tune with Aether. That actually seems pretty okay. You fix your mail. And we get that energy, so we got four. We got two energies, two so energy it looks hosters. Like, it looks like Donate did not table. I don't think it was there yet. I thought it was. It might have been. That's so sad. That's stupid. I'm I mad. think it was this pack, actually. I'll take Pro Red, dude. Root wall of time unfollowed. <laughs> Thoughts on the impending chaos draft? When is that? If that starts tomorrow, I'll be okay. I'll do some chaos drafts tomorrow. That'd be all right. Favorite graphic novel and or comic storyline? Hmm. 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 <laughs> I really wish I knew what that was from. It's on the tip of my tongue, dude. Um, I mean, I really like Sin City. Hmm. I'm pretty sure mine is Hush. Whatever, I'll take Night. Nighty Tootie. Jeroka's Command's good. That or Sandman. One of the two. Michael Sandman. Bring me a dream. Boom, 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 boom. Make it the Michael that I've never seen. I can't believe Donate didn't come back. That's so stupid. Who's Andrew, Mike? What? Oh, Pure Steel Paladin came back. That guy draws us a card. You know, if we have any... Uh... Ooh, Watchmen's a good one, too. Also, I think the movie's better than people get credit for. I do, too. I like the movie a lot. I think it's pretty pretty, pretty close to the original. Charm uh, draft confirmed. This is, a, this is a command, not a charm, you, you dirtle. You favorite, old dirtle, you. Favorite fruit flavor of ice cream, banana. Yeah, that wasn't even close. He's like a he's like a real banana weirdo. You could make a real argument that Snapcaster does kind of draw you a card. However, this does say draw a card on the cycle. It's true. This says draw a card too. Mm -hmm. So I think it comes down to Decree of Justice or Explore. I think I'd rather have a Decree. I would rather have... Well, you know, Spectrum, Musical Interest. Spectrum? Uh, anywhere from jazz to old school hip-hop to new school hip-hop to rock to alternative to indie to emo to post-punk. I think it's pretty wide. I think it's a pretty wide spectrum. Hmm. <sighs> La da 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 da, scoob and dee doos. Oh, this says draw a card on it. Uh, 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 uh. So does Thought Not That here, wasn't though. a top eight? This has been a really old it's, top eight. It was an old top eight. I really want Confiscate or I want Simic Signet. But I think we're going to take Thought Knots here because I think it's better than JM Daytona by a sizable margin. And if Lana Royce comes back, and we also have Caves of Coilus already. I don't know if that's good enough, though, but we'll see. Mike, what's your favorite banana? Uh, the delicious kind? I don't know, man. When they're just ripe enough, but not too ripe? Hollow, this says draw a card on it. Damn it. Dang it! Oh, it's so bad. God, we're missing like real, real legitimate picks here. Yep. I mean, I guess that's the point, Mike, right? What's your favorite wide spectrum? Uh, I got nothing on that. Wide spectrum? I have no idea what that means. Oh! What'd you do? I took this because I was literally trying to unclick it, it was like highlighted. And I don't know how Magic Online works, so that's really obnoxious. Well, we'll probably play it. Yeah, but now I feel bad about it because I feel like I unintentionally 
took a stupid card that... Well, none of these say draw a card on it. Yeah, so we got a freebie, but I don't think it's anything good in here. Probably Manowar. Yeah, I was thinking Manowar, too. Paul Manowar. <laughs> oh, that's a little meme. That's a little, uh, little, little campaign finance manager meme. It was a Manafort joke. God. I get it. I guess it's Regal Force. It says draw a card. True. Come on. None of these other ones say draw a card on them? Crying out loud, really? Nope. Like, I just can't even play this. That's unfortunate. Why don't I, I'm passing, like, an Oracle and an Eldrazi Sky Spawner. That's pretty brutal. I don't think this deck is playable. <laughs> I hate to say it, but it's not looking good. Yeah, it's looking a little rough. <coughs> we should have had a specific number of vetoes, because getting Cruel Ultimatum when there's actual playables in the pack. Are... I think Oracle does draw cards, but it doesn't say draw a card on the, on the actual card. So. I don't know. I'm trying to be true to the stipulation itself. I think Drowner does help us... Um, cast this guy which is nice but I don't feel great about getting it when I shouldn't have okay none far seek elves or underground river are our options here probably underground river because we have underground here. river and we only have uh, well I guess this can get anything really but I do like thought not seer as a reason to play that. God, I wish Wood Elves got anything other than nothing. Also, you can't just add uh, colorless lands to your deck, right? That's not a thing. No, there's no wastes. You guys remember when Ban Eldrazi was the scourge of modernity to be banned like before? Yes, I do. Man, those were the days. Mike, you need to be introduced to different, different bananas. Hmm. If you know what we mean. He told you not to do that, and you just did it anyway. You're right. It's hard. It was real For hard. Shame. You're a for shame. This guy says draw a card, and I actually kind of like him. I guess. We have to pass but cap size. Who cares about cap size, man? What you ever you... play with cap size in six mana? You just win the game. No, you don't. Maybe in the 80s, dude. No, you, you pretty much won the game. Maybe in the 80s, dude. <laughs> you mean before the game was invented? Yeah, you like Verdant Force or you like Lightning Greaves? Or you like Spike Weaver? Ooh, Spike Weaver! Is that the one that fogs? Yeah. Seems alright. Or you like Lightning Greaves? Or Regal Force? Verdant Force? Regal, Regal mm. Verdant? Verdant Force is fine, I guess. Man, I don't know. You gotta tell me. Yeah, sure. Verdant Force. Alright, it's like Lightning Greaves. Okay. <laughs> well, this came back? Yes, we have to take it. Well, no, duh, it came back. Are you kidding me? No, I guess that's a good point. <laughs> oh, tap boy. four and tap it to draw a card? Jeez. Squirrel Nest. Oh, man, take that Fire of Industries. We have literal one artifact. It's basically just oh, the wastes. Fair. Well, we need them though. Eh, maybe. Take raging ravine. No, hey, no, we're not red. Never mind. Like, yeah, red's the one color we're like not even interested in. What yeah, squirrel? Take missed? that. All right. What that makes hell? squirrels. Familiarize them. <laughs> look! Look with your familiar eyes. Hey, don't cut them yet. We're at 24 cards. He's a good bird. Why Why him, though? <laughs> why him? <laughs> what did he ever do? I think we got worse oh, cards yeah! than familiar. Yeah! That's gas. That's exciting. Pretty sure we're cutting Regal Force. Oh, wow. Why did our curve look so much better in the... Why did it look better in the thing? It looks terrible now. Oh, my God. What happened? <laughs> Before it looked like there were like three, there were like four dudes here, and I was like, "Oh, look at this great curve!" It looked like this. 
Now it looks like this. Uh, I think we cut circular logic. Really? How does that one work again? It's for it's every just other a copy. No, it's three mana. Counter its spell unless someone plays one for each card in your graveyard. So usually oh, okay. it's a mana leak. And then if you have compulsion, you just get it for free. Like Your mom's curve looks better. Wow. That is aggressive, man. <laughs> How does Regal Force work again? Each draw card for each creature you control. What happened? 15 Zaxor bits. Wanted to rhyme, but I'm tired like Tequila Mike. Take some bits instead. Bits. <laughs> Cut all the card draw spells. Why are you people the way that you are? Brugal Force is draw a card for every creature you can For every draw. green creature. Cut that dude right now. Yeah, agreed. All right, there's the deck. Done. All right, so we're definitely putting a swamp in because we have uh, a tune with Aether, and uh, yeah, that's probably the only one that's gonna get thing. Are you okay, man? You fall asleep already? Every day I am. Every day you are. That's right. Uh, cut one of you. Add one of you. So we have six, seven, eight. No, six, seven, six, seven, eight. One, one. That seems fine. Done. Save it and blave it. Hmm. Burn? What are you saying right now? What's going on? I also don't hate Dramoka's command. If you like it so much, why don't you marry it? Uh, I'm waiting for it to ask. Okay. Chad is full of sad now? Why? What happened? What's going on right now? They're trying to find quotes on themselves. <laughs> wow. Yes. Yes. Yes, Commander. Destroy the child. Dis destroy the child. <laughs> destroy the child. That was very good. Uncomfortably good. Old Man River. Old Man River. Mike, are you drinking with me tonight? I wish. Oh, look who finally decided to show up. After all the questions have been answered. Dang it, Sarah. I wish, he says. Give me a give me a painful truce. We got the mana base for days up in here. <laughs> Ooh, enlightened toots. Wonder what you're gonna get here. Land tax. Land tax. You do not play land. Play land tax. Destroy the. I can't do it. Destroy the chat. Man, I had it better before. Destroy the chat. Oh no. What are you Yoda? Funny joke. I'm actually not going to play land. I'm just going to play thought knots here. And if you don't want to develop your board because of that, that is totally fine. Destroy. The child. No, still nothing. Let me see what you've got. Do do do. Oh, you actually don't have a third land. Interesting. Destroy the child. Your hand is up pretty bad. Destroy the child. <laughs> I feel like we just take this white knight. Yeah, they can't get a land, right? I ain't got no reason to play a land, boy. It's your land, boy! 
Yep, you got it. Greaves. Don't grieve for me, Argentina. That's actually a pretty good draw. Three turn clock coming at you. I'll get you next time, Gadget. Hey, you next do, time. You gotta do that voice. That the Dr. Claw voice? Yeah. That was Destroy the Child. That was grisly. That that's hurt a little bit. That's the great voice for it. Blue, 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 green. We'll just get another green because then we have three green for a Kodama. I'm like, I'll attune with either get a land. Decline to play my land. Wow. Okay, so now we have Blossoming Defense and Counterspell. Pretty good. I'll get you next time. It hurts. That's a painful voice. All right. Pass it up. Pa pass it up. Just go to discard and discard. Whoop, just go to discard land. This is what happens when you go to get land tax. Don't ever play a game of land chicken with me, buddy. I got a bird of paradise. We won that game. Destroy the child. <laughs> I think Drogas Command can come in. They had a They had a land tax. And a bunch of yeah. bunch of artifacts and things. Yeah. Bueller. Destroy the child. Hey, Mike, did you know that Alexa can play in the club by 50 Cent? No, I didn't know that. Thank you for telling me. I like how they put at you and then ask me a question. What are you doing, man? I was seeing how still I could be. And if it looked like the screen froze? That doesn't work if I don't know about it. So? Uh, da, 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 at Frank Labore, hey Mike. Yeah, why do they at me? Did you know that Alexa? Yeah, They right. wanted the red text. So I'd pay attention. Yeah, well, it takes a lot for Mike to pay attention. Sometimes you gotta destroy the child. <laughs> What are those? <laughs> They're little wire clips. What oh. are those? What are those? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, I just got one question for you. <laughs> what are those? Oh, God. How was the subpar taco night? This is a this is a above average. Oh, Mike had twelve tacos tonight, which is pretty insane. Uh, it was eleven. Oh, my bad, you. eleven. He had eleven tacos. Boy, was it a lot of tacos. He's basically a former shell of himself, a former taco shell of himself. We're gonna play this now because we're gonna ponder. Actually, with ponder, it's actually better to, yeah, to crack after. I forgot the wrong one. It doesn't matter. Oh boy. All right, so shuffle. That's not bad considering we have degree in hand, I guess. He's more taco than man now. Twisted and evil. Spicy and delicious. All right, so we have all of the makings of a beautiful, a beautiful cryptic command here. We have the makings of a, a beautiful cryptic command coming up. Coming up for you guys in the next hour, we have a beautiful cryptic command. The stream is now a taco support group. That's a... Uh... This is my worn power stone. Beautifully worn by Might Right Mike. Uh, this is another Mike. Do you feel a connection to our opponent because your names are Mike? No. <laughs> no. That's stupid. Don't be stupid. <laughs> what, are you some kind of dummy? Is your hunter back there? Yeah. <sighs> we have a black land, which is nice. It can cast painful truths if we draw it. It also helps us cast Thought Not Seer. Oh, yeah. That's, that's, that's definitely a pickable thing. Um, the only thing we need double or triple green for is Kodama of the North Tree. So the options we have with a black slash colorless land are far superior. 
You belong to the city. Did you know that? No. Whatever. Well, that's something, isn't it? That's something, too. I got a lot of things. I got a lot of things, Michael. This is actually problematic, I think. I might just have to bounce it and... Bounce and be done. I might have to bounce and be done. Did they play... Hold on. What happened? Third forward? Did they play their guy without a trigger? No trigger? I no think. triggy. I'm tempted to block and bounce this at the end of the bounce the sword at the end of the turn, just to uh, be able to counter on the way back down. Or if I mean if they if they play a guy, we can counter the guy, bounce the sword, which is pretty good. I think we have to get rid of the sword though, because it's pretty problematic. Uh, return this. What? All right, that was weird. <laughs> that was weird. Flat bottom taco shells make the rockin' world go around. Do they? Mm. Do they really? Oh, I played that completely. Oh, we actually don't have second green, so that's actually fine. One, two, three. Yeah, this is actually fine. We're going to void slime it. We could have a tune to get a green uh, and played that, but I actually kind of like keeping Decree up here. Oh, I see. Fascinating. During your main phase. Hmm. I'm very confused. Yep, that's gonna get... What did you get? Land tax again? I don't understand. Every day is my good Sunday. One, two, three, four. We can actually play a fifth land and play... Wow, we got everything. We can actually use Aeon Chronicler here. Suspend for two. That seems pretty good considering the board right now. X can't be zero. Does it say that on the card? Yeah, okay, X can't be zero. Nice. So next turn we can go, we can do lots of things. We can go tune for a plane or a forest, play the forest, play visionary. Guess see what we draw here. The one thing this deck doesn't lack is card drawing. It's actually pretty nice. You doing okay? What do you got on your nose, man? You got custard on your nose? Oh, Jareth is actually pretty hard to deal with. You trolling me, man? Yeah, man. Hmm. Looking for an answer to this guy, unfortunately. He's pretty problematic. I guess there's no reason not to play a tune here. It just literally replaces itself. And then we can still make one guy with Decree. What turn was this? Seven? How does that Gerard guy work? Uh, four, seven. Whenever it, gets, whenever it blocks, it gets plus seven, plus seven. And uh, you can use the white to give it protection from a color of your choice. So it can just be like pro green, pro blue, attack you for four. 
That seems good. That seems good. I yeah. can be like this. This guy's also like an 8-8 when it comes down, though, so that's pretty good. I called your mom a bits last night. That's true. I did do that. Are they coming at us? That's aggressive. I don't think we're ever going to have a chance to block this guy, so I might as well just block the two. We go to 11. Next turn we take 6. God, I wouldn't be surprised if Jareth just kills us. Jareth is super impressive in this cube. Can we, like, just almost kill them with this stupid Aaron Chronicler if we Sphinx's Revelation here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We draw 5 cards. Not quite lethal. Yeah, but it's like a 2 turn clock. I guess we just have to hope they don't have Path or... Go to 11. Okay, that's actually pretty good. Put you to 9. Gain a million. Okay. Well, now we can just discard a bunch of lands, so that's cool. We have to discard 4 cards, we can actually just discard all the lands. 1, 2, 3, 4... Oops, all spells. We are Flintstone kids. A million strong and growing. Red? Hmm. Hmm. I'm confused, man. Is Lab Maniac in the cube? I don't know. I don't think so. No, because I don't think Lab Maniac ever won it. Lab Maniac ain't win shit. <laughs> he wins a lot of Commander games. Does he? Mm -hmm. I guess that's true, because instead of beating five people, you just have to fulfill a thing on your deck. Oh, Jareth is staying home. Do you have anything that gives float? Don't think so. Dang. Hmm. Hmm. How many biddies can we make here? 14 biddies. So this guy gets plus 7, plus 7, right? So it's a 11, 14. <laughs> Crying out loud. We can Painful Truths. Which would put us down to 7 and then put us up to 10. Yeah, this is hard to deal with. None of your dudes have reach, though. Maybe we just make infinite angels. Can we make three angels? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. No. Dang it. Make two angels. Mm, this two turn clock. Send me an angel. Oh. Oh. We can, or we can just... So here's the thing. If we put a bunch of things on the board and hopes to make three angels the next turn... That's basically the same as just putting up two angels this turn and then right. killing them in two turns anyway. Alternatively, making one, two, three, four, five, one, ones, which I don't think is as strong. Although they won't see it coming. And we get to draw a card. Oh, we do need another white too, so never mind. So I guess we play birds this turn. Well, we could make the one ones. Is that a good is that good enough though? They go block here. We do get to keep circular logic up, which is nice. Mm -hmm. So 
So we can actually go. We can play. Uh, we can play birds, or man of war and circular logic here. One, two, three. Well, man of war will bounce the rabble masters so they don't go ham next turn with it. Jareth is such a beast, man. They played one of these, so now we know f five of the nine, ten cards in your hand? Okay. I accept. Second red. Yep. What? They played that red, boy. Alright. Peace out. Oh, we know Rabble Master, so we know five of the nine cards. Five of nine. Send me a mic, B. Who saw that coming? That is not a dude I necessarily care about. This is basically a hard counter now because they're not going to have 12 mana. You don't know their mana life. You don't know. Thankfully, Aeon Chronicler is still a 5-5 five five if we counter something, so we don't have to worry about it. We can still block here. Oh, what up, Hodge Goo? Weird. Oh, you're just going to give it Pro Blue. I see. I guess we're going to nine, boys. I really don't want to go to six here with the Painful Truths. That leaves us one turn to deal with this guy. Did you ever end up dripping that sauce in your hole? <laughs> Not quite. Well, it's too bad, buddy. I don't care about that. So you can have it. I don't care about that either. None of these things are scary. Especially if we make a million one ones. Ha ha ha. We know four of the six cards in your hand. Good times. Good times. Everything. Oh, they tapped out? Oh, that's gas. So we have to put a counter on this guy, otherwise it'll be a 6-6. Six, six. So, put a counter. He becomes a 6-6, six, six, but then he goes back to a 7-7 seven, seven and we fight here. You have no white mana up? Oh, boy. Mistakes from it. Aid. Peace out. <laughs> Why would you tap out? This guy is like unbeatable, man. Yeah, this is the only thing really keeping him in the game. This has four damage on it, so we don't want to go lower than that. I think we're probably just going to play Compulsion here. That'll put us to six. Actually, we'll play Bird too because Compulsion. Well, make sure you don't accidentally kill your Alien Chronicle. No, here. we'll make it go five five. But 5-5 five, five safe because uh, next turn, if we circular logic, we're going to draw a card from the compulsion, putting it up to a 6-6, six, six, and then we get to stay at a 5-5 five, five because of the logic. So, Unfortunately, you can only painful truths 4-3. Everything is all right. Man. Woof. That was brutal. Yeah, but you're glad you have your veteran motorist. <laughs> Just that little nerd? Okay. Oh, they got more? They got three more? 
Reveals, reveals. So they revealed Plains, Mountain, Mountain, and they played a mountain. Okay. So we know six of the nine cards in your hand. Six of nine, like Star Wars. Uh, that's not what it's called. Ugh. Where's the Aaron meme? You done messed up, hey, hey, Ron. That's definitely fitting. You know what happens when you uh, tap out so that you can't save your Jareth? <laughs> Choice memeage. Uh, I feel like that's probably worth countering, right? Yeah. Definitely. Everything is all right. Oh, let's make sure we click this. Okay. Blue. Pay 12 mana. I mean 13 mana. 13 Paul Manaforts. Pay 13 Paul Manaforts. Nailed it. How many angels can we make here? Like a billion, right? Yeah, something like that. So, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, I'm going to six. We can make three, which is a one turn clock, I think. Yeah, let's do that. Why don't you give him haste, nerd? I'm not good at Magic the Gathering, uh, the trading card game by Richard Garfield. I mean, that's how it's spelled. It's spelled A-A-R-O-N, so... They declined to get any more. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. They chose, they're like, I ain't gonna use my land tax anymore. Why not? Armageddon? What if they go Wrath of God and Armageddon? That would be interesting. Okay, Yosei the Morning Star. You got it. Give way to sacrifice Yosei. That would might that would probably kill us. You play the planes. You have five cards. You have one card that we don't know about. Yosei is a troubling gentleman. We have eight cards in our deck. That's not a lot at all. What's Let's our answer? Some more of it. So they block. Actually, the nice thing about this is Yosei doesn't actually die. Is there anything in our deck that can deal with Yose? Like a bounce thing? Let's find out. Uh, Sky Spawner wins. Which is a pretty funny thing to say if you think about it. I mean, presuming they, their last card is not like a removal spell. Yo say, everything is all right. Lightning grieves out of sight. All right, I think we did it. Oh, pay costs. Lucky, 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 lucky. Well, what are you going to do? Nothing at all, I suppose. We have one, two, three, four, five blockers. They're going to have five attackers. We can attack with all three of these. Put them to... Put them to four. And then they might die next turn. Do we play a land this turn? If not, I'll 100% play an Oran Viper. Okay. Avatar is going to be a 3-3, three, three, which is fine. Okay. I think this should be fine. So, we know they have five lands in hand. Now you're going to choose. Okay. 
Interesting. They chose Mountain Plains Mountain. So we know all eight of the cards in your hand. Shut up and take my money. Five mistakes were made. Burp, eight bucks. <laughs> oh, for crying out loud. It's pretty good. Oh, come on. Pretty sure we just lost the Bane Slayer Angel. I don't think we have a card in our deck that can actually deal with that. Uh, Mana War Elves is already in our... What the hell is a Mana War Elves? <laughs> <laughs> you know what it is. It's in play right now. That's what it is. Mana War Elves. That's gas. I don't know what our four cards are. Uh, with Twitch, you can just download the videos from Twitch. Well, that is a thing. It'll kill the Bane Slayer Angel. It will. We can also draw a card. Off of Compulsion. We have three cards left, though. Yeah. I'm trying to think of what else is in our deck. Yeah, we should really save our deck as an image so we can always look at it. Swing with everything seems bad. They have two first strikers. They just go block your 3-2, block your 2-2. Two, two. Like, 4-4 four, four gets blocked by 5-5. Five, five. I mean, they're going to gain life here, so they're, they're actually at 9. I don't think swinging out ever wins us a game here. The problem is they still go to 9, I and mean, they have one, we have one angel. Mana War Elf Buck, one Mana War Elf Buck. <laughs> oh, God, I love it. They have 10 cards? My God. I wish I knew what they had. If we, oh, we had, I really do. Yeah, it'd make a really big difference. I wish. Why can't you? I don't know why you can't see your deck. If I knew I had like Eternal Witness, I'd grab. Oh, we have. Uh, no, nope, Ponder's here. Okay. We know there are things that draw you cards. Maybe. What? 101.01. Thanks for providing some joy during a long, dark time and for keeping me entertained on my walks. You're both excellent gentlemen and much appreciated. Please enjoy. The Shadows, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Wow. After all you've been through, man, the least you have to do is keep me supported. That's crazy. But I'm really glad that, uh, you know, YouTube videos and stuff helped out. Like, seriously. Thank you so much, man. That's crazy, dude. You are awesome. Man. Man. Thought Not Seer is one of the cards. Yeah, that's fair. They didn't use land tax and they played a mountain. Okay, so these are your seven now. The Shadows, dude. Thank you so much. That is a super generous thing to do. Really appreciate that. No, you are awesome. How dare you? How dare you? All I'm trying to do is keep you company on your walks. Nope, don't. Can you imagine if I block with the Shroud one? I can imagine, yes, that would lose us the game. Hopefully this works. I can't imagine it not working. I mean, they still go to 9, which is problematic, but... Feeling the love on the last night of same, man. You guys are great. Great. Oh, they got something? What is this? Clawbacks. <laughs> Earthquake. Oh, my God. 
It's her life, dude. Had I known, this would have done it. Could have tapped down Yosei and the other one. We literally could have won the game if we just remembered that was in our deck. Well, how would we get to that? You drew three cards. We have Compulsion. Oh, right. You can just keep discarding cards. Yeah, we just tap six mana. One, two, three, four, five, six. We still have one, two, three, four, five, and a bird. Dang. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, their last two top decks were literally um, Bane Slayer Angel and uh, Earthquake. And Earthquake. Oh, yeah, and Yosei. Yeah, they go Yosei, Bane Slayer Angel, Earthquake. Okay. Got me. Tabbing stuff seems good. Pro Red. Target creature gets picked from red until end of turn. That doesn't seem terrible. 7.99 paying the rent bug. <laughs> oh, wow. I guess we did. We, we did a thing. Man, that's amazing. What a time to be alive. Oh, you guys are amazing. Josh, thank you so much, buddy. As we're doing your stipulation, as I live and breathe. I'm going to bring this guy in. Really? Pro Red, he lives against Earthquake, Goblin Rabble Master, Lightning Helix. You can give your other creatures Pro Red. Okay. I didn't see any white removal, right? Yeah, that's fair. Where'd he go? He's in he's right there. He's in your sideboard still. Up top. Right oh, there. he's in like a i I'm like looking at I'm like white, white, white. Where the heck is he? Oh, it's like this weird shade of white. I understand now. Yeah, I see. I'm gonna take the wood elves out, maybe. They seem pretty underwhelming, especially if our opponent has... Uh, it's, it, like, it literally just gets a forest. Uh, Time to start working on that spooky rent. Because <laughs> October, man. Right, no, I get it. No, I get it. I understand. What's the date? When, when should this end? Nine. How many days are in... 19, no, wait, that's 28. You have a calendar right there, dude. Yeah, but I gotta click over to it, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. 30. See, it's not even a real date. I just made up a fake date. Boom. Starting fresh. I'm just gonna submit here. God, I can't believe that, man. I actually like this hand. Thank you. Walladale, welcome back, buddy. 46 months in a row. That is a pretty unreasonable amount of time. That is a ridiculous, ridiculous. Look, we got a Man of War Elf. That's pretty good. <laughs> oh, that's gas. We're looking at your clock? Yeah. Why, is it your bedtime yet? Yeah, man. No, I it ain't. To go to bed. No, you got like seven more hours, bro. What'd you do with your finger? I don't know what you're doing right now. <laughs> I don't know either, man. What's wrong with you? Who knows? Why are you this way? I want to get some water. Okay, bye. I probably shouldn't have cranked this, but I don't care. It's just going to be a forest on top anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh, all right. Spoopy. 30 days, half September, April, June, and November. September, April. That's actually... Always wanted to be the first on a new month, Buck Buck. <laughs> Hodge Galashi, congrats. You made it, buddy. You made it. Looks like you made it. Let's see how you scry here. Because I really don't want to Man of War into your guy. Because the taco cart is closing soon. <laughs> I gotta go. I gotta go check the taco cart. One on the bottom, one on the top. All right. Well, I want to play this Oran Viper. Can't do it yet. What are the odds this Bird of Paradise gets lightning bolted, huh? K 
count the months on your knuckles? What the hell does that mean? Uh, do my patrons count towards rent? No. No, they do not. Okay. This is all very confusing. I'm confused. <laughs> I don't understand Knuckles. You don't understand Knuckles? Yeah, don't make a Sonic the Hedgehog joke, man. <laughs> why? Why, why, why make it or why don't make it? What's wrong with Knuckles? What's wrong with Sonic jokes? Which month is the Moose Knuckles? <laughs> I'm gonna have to stop streaming now. What what did I miss, man? Nothing, don't worry about it. It's talking about knuckles and things. Hmm. You alright, man? You got a little tequila in there? I should. Motoring! I don't feel like the Zoran Viper's ever getting in there, so. Woo! You put too much in there, didn't you? Oh, boy. This definitely tastes like Melted Jolly Rancher. Just making sure I got some left in there. Oh, that's a good one. Definitely bouncing that. Or just tapping it down with Dr. Owner, probably. Use your knuckles to figure out which month you have. What is this? That's what you do with your lands. Oh, yeah, you're right. I was doing a little sandstorm. They didn't come at me. <sighs> yeah, that's a hell of a curve. Yep, two, three, four, five. Motoring. I'm pretty sure we lose this game, which sucks because we literally won last game if we just actually remember we had Dr. Owner in our deck. That's really frustrating. Drowner did help me top A to PT. Which is sad because it could have won our last game and we could have been done and gone to the next round. But here we are. Here we are. Turn around. What? Said, here we are, turn around. Here we are, turn around. Mm -hmm. Come at me, brew. Oh, they are coming at me, brew. Every now and then I fall apart. And I need you more than I. I need you more than ever. Get in your life, bruh. Didn't they do that wrong? Yes. <laughs> to the surprise of no one. Come on, Mike Reich, Mike. Let's go. Let's make it happen. Mm. 
Boom. Boom, for real. No, no, he fixed it. He fixed it. It's been remedied as. Um. Mm, um. Mm. Now oh, that kind of worked out for us. Now they're just going to earthquake it and leave themselves with Wingmate Rock and us at one. No, you didn't do that. We have like one turn to deal with the wingmate rock, and I don't feel good about it. Lightning helix. Why didn't you cast that last turn and kill my board and then put me to three while you were at 19? Wow, that's so weird. Why wouldn't you do that? You have literally nothing in hand. Yeah, I don't know either. What in the hell? This makes no sense. You would have literally wiped my board. You had nothing else, and it doesn't even hit your wingmate rock because it has flying. Maybe you forgot it's non-flying. <laughs> lucky, 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 lucky. Oh, man. That's amazing to me. Forgetting it's non-flying does not make you better. It makes it actually worse. Yeah. Wow. Jesus, this is the worst, man. Woo! It's okay, I top decked Urza's Rage. The right card I need is always right on the top. Alright, well, whatever, man. I know Fushino Panic, too. Who is this, actually? Is this a... Is this a viewer? Is that where I know this name from? This is a stream, bro? Oh, we got Freddy Bones in the chat. He's peeping. He's peeping, peeping and creeping. Peeping, creeping. What? <laughs> I think you're just having a stroke. Peeping, creeping. Now you sound like Herbert from the Family Guy. Hey, peeping, creep. Frank, can I give you a stop too? Go 3-0 with an awesome... No, that's a stop. That's a stip, not a stop. But I, I appreciate it, nonetheless. I'm going to play this, because if we draw a green next turn, we can go Kodamo of the North Tro. Unless they counter this. They didn't. And you're... <laughs> you guys remember when Mike was drunk and he read Austin as autism? And it said right in, right in the autism? Oh, we're having a drunk stream on Friday, I think. Get paid Thursday, gonna buy me a nice flavored rum. <laughs> what if I live stream the alcohol purchase and people can can vote on what you drink? Ooh, that's interesting. No, they make me drink something bad though. I don't think so. I think they love you too much. Come on, one forest. It kinda counts. Mm mm. Oh, but if I get too drunk, I can't go play Commander. Play Commander on Thursday and get to do Drunk Stream on Friday. Yeah, I guess I don't have to double up Commander days. <laughs> That's a solid Man of War Elf. Oh, Lightning Greaves? You can put that on this Kodamo. It's just Lightning Greaves. Is that good? Mike, I'll tip half the cost of some reasonably good scotch if you'll drink that. Ooh. I would drink that. Although I don't know much about scotch, so I wouldn't know what nice scotch is. How about who, Josh, you tell us what to get, and we'll get that. Yeah, sure. Also, if you have any I mean, things I can mix it with, or if I should just drink it straight, let me know. Did you say things you can mix it with? Because you're a mix? Mix it with. Hmm. Yeah, you can't equip the shroud. It was a joke. It was a, that, that was, that's the joke. Okay. 
I think it's probably this. Oh, not four locos, man. Those things are gross. Oh. <laughs> and they're really bad for you. And you know they're outlawed. They were outlawed, and you don't get to mix scotch. Not that's not how it works. <laughs> that's fair. Mike's not used to man's drinks. He's used to, um, you know, like flavorful things. You got nowhere to talk, man. I don't drink, so what am I gonna say? Exactly. Exactly. Fireball, I fireball's okay. Oh God, are we dead? Jesus, we're dead, aren't we? I'm really afraid right now. I don't think I've ever been this scared. <laughs> He's only used to 75 straight tequila. <laughs> oh, we're not dead. Oh. Bad things are happening at the Circle K right now. No, Mazan, sir. I will not go quite as hard as I did last time. That was not the right spell. <laughs> well, you get an opening. Here's your opening. Kill me. It seems like everyone has a bad fireball story. I think because fireball is easy to drink. It's like, because it just tastes like cinnamon. Cinnamon's easy to drink? Yeah. You're a weird guy. Well, it's hard to explain, but cinnamon flavored whiskey is just it's hard delicious. to explain do 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 that's the song I wrote it's called it's hard to explain do 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 shut up Michael. Frank email me with how much Highland Park 12 year Valkyrie costs and I'll tip half the amount oh my god that sounds amazing dude I have no idea I that... don't know what that is but it sounds really expensive let's find Highland out Highland Park 12 year Valkyrie Jesus I might have a shot of that I guess you don't. Do you not have shots, or do you, do you just have, to have like? That's oh, like, that's not as bad as I thought. It's like it looks like a sixty bones, but we'll see. I thought he was giving some age stuff that was like a couple hundred. Like bucks. some Pappy Van Winkle. Is that a thing? Oh, you don't know about Pappy? No. There's a limited amount made, like every, uh, every, I don't know, I think it's every year, maybe? <laughs> yeah. 3K, woo! Please don't shoot, see, I don't know drinks, man. I feel like this guy's doing a real good job. You're doing a real good, Kodama of maybe the North touch water, so, so, scotch and, scotch and water is acceptable? I haven't ever heard someone describe Fireball as delicious. Are you drunk right now? <laughs> La Volgan 16, too, if you'd rather that. What's that? Let's find out what that is. Lagavulin. Man, Josh coming coming strong with the alcohol hits over <laughs> here, man. Woo! The problem is I want something that I can just go to the liquor store and buy. You know. I imagine you can do that. I don't think... See, you look at this liquor store and you go to it and you're like, you only got like Four Locos and, and crazy party tequilas. It's not like a party store. It's a legit alcohol store, right? Yeah, you're right. They probably have nicer stuff, I imagine. Why would you kill that guy? He didn't do anything to you. Oh, yeah. Those fancy balls of ice. The circular ones. The big old ones. Do you ever uh do you ever get tired of peeping and creeping? Never. Isn't Maker's Mark relatively cheap? At least some of it. Some kinds. Do we just play Doctor Owner here? I hope they don't kill us. I don't know if I've ever actually had straight scotch. I've had bourbon. I've had whiskey. I don't know if I've had scotch. Wow, this conversation got real deep into the alcohol tank.
We got another Mana War Elf. <laughs> Where? Oh, God. <laughs> oh, these are all incredible. Wow, this card would be amazing. Yeah, it'd be pretty good. It's just a bounce dude. It has no power and toughness, which is awkward, though. I don't know how it can be a creature. Creature, Mike's imagination. Can I take it back and cast it now? Oh, I was literally going to type a thinking emoji. I'll just say thinking emoji instead. He'll know what I mean. They lived in the sea, but had the forest in their hearts. <laughs> oh, that's gas. Peep and creep. I want to bring Jorokas Command in, in case they do have... Uh, if they have Splinter Twin, it's great against both halves. It kills Kiki Jiki, Pestermite, and it kills Splinter Twin, so... That's pretty cool. Uh, also, Crimson Acolyte can target Deceiver, Exarch, or Splinter Twin and give them Pro Red. Ooh. Or Deceiver, Exarch, or Pestermite, rather. So then if they try to like put it on, you can just be like, Boop, Pro Red, you bruh. Give him a little boop. I'm not a fan of Crown Royal. Kind of meh. You're kind of meh. Wow. Got him. Guys, did you hear me get him? I got him. Josh is only drinking the Crown Royal so he can put all his dice in it afterwards. <laughs> That's what all the cool kids do. You know it. Peep and creep. Calm down now. Y'all calm down now. I'm just gonna you open. Drink some vodka drink. You drink a whiskey drink. Okay. Oh, these are both literally fifty fifty eight sixty one. That's hilarious. They're the same price. But which is better? Witches are better. Hey man, did you see that with that witch hunt today? God, so sad. Caught some bona fide witches. I'm a bona fide witch. I do not want these cards. I'm just gonna shuffle. Actually, is the keeping the attune just better? No, because I'd rather just draw a random card. That's a better card. Man, I like that just by just by doing a drunk stream on Friday, the chat's like, yeah, I'll pay for half your alcohol. <laughs> Man. Royal Crown Cola was created with the perfect mix of Royal Wow, that's insane. That does mix you're like That's amazing. Don't stop it. The chat, Frank, I haven't... Yeah, but it's... Yeah, but it's different, Josh. Do we want an Eldrazi Sky Spawner? We could just block block. It's like the perfect spoil to PNLR, right? It's pretty good. No, it's not, because this is a floater. and We get a ground guy out of it, but it's still pretty close. We're all chat, Mike. Mike should get sponsored on the stream by Billy's Bargain Tequila. That doesn't sound good. Anything with bargain in the name? Mm -mm. There's certain things in life that you don't want to bargain. Like Dormammu, for example. I wish I had more than one green. I wish I was a little bit taller. I wish I was baller. Wish I had a habit in our right. <laughs> bargain mattress? No, I wouldn't buy a bargain mattress either. No, definitely not. I spent too much time on a mattress to like 
Drowner of Hope or Thought Knots here. They literally gave us both of the Eldrazi that were in my uh, Proto Top 8 deck. <laughs> Can I be that guy for a second? Sure. I think it's Thought Knots here, especially when we have Blossoming Defenses. God, I want both of them, though. You doing okay? Man, this is a lot of... I have come to Bargle. Wow. This is a lot of mana they're making. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Are they going to Cruel Ultimatum us? No, they can't with these. So if you ever get those drafts where you're two colors and nobody else seems to be in those colors but the fixing never seems to wheel or get passed, pretty sure I was the guy taking the fixing during my draft. <laughs> Oh, clearly. One, two, three, four, five. We have six mana. You belong to the city. Really? You're going to be this guy? Oh. 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 Well... Watch, they have Splinter Twin, uh, Kiki Jiki, and Pester Might in hand. And whatever we take, they're going to get the opposing, the other piece. That doesn't make any sense. If they had those, if they had like Kiki Jiki, Pester Might, and Vampiric Tutor, they would wait to see what we took and then they'd go get it. Because if I take Kiki Jiki, you'd have to get Splinter Twin. If I took Pester Might, you'd have to get Deceiver Exarch. So you don't know which I'm going to take. So if that was the case, you'd wait. Do you have two? Do you have three lands in hand? And you're just going to Vampiric Tutor? I bet you have three lands in hand. You dirty biscuit. Oh my! This is why we do that. This is why we do what we do. Agony Warp and Incinerate. Well, Incinerate is just worse, right? So you got a Warp Arena? No, you got an Incinerate Arena. Okay. Let's see what you draw. And I feel pretty safe with the Sphinx's Rev in hand, unless you... Bituminous Blast. That's a good one. That is a solid dude. Into a pester mite. Okay. So we know you have incinerate in hand. And one other card. It's not bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We can draw four next turn. I think we're just gonna painful trues. We're not really at much risk. Grievous. Black, blue, green. No. So we want to keep this up. Uh, we have another blue in hand, so we can go blue, black, white. So we're taking five here for painful trees. But we have Sphinx's Rev, so shrug. Shrug. <laughs> you belong to the city. Do you know that? You have failed this city. Really? Destroy the child. <laughs> Funny joke. So we take three here. God, just sad. What a sad day. Pump. Pump, 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 pump you up. So you have one unknown. Could be a land. God, we take seven here? Jesus. Oh, eight? God.
One, two, three, one, two, we get to draw five here. We take one, so we get to gain four, so we'll go to 11. I guess we're just passing here, keeping up Void Slime and... <laughs> Mark belongs to the city! We're just gonna die this PNLR. Yeah, I'm really surprised at how, uh... How much work this Eldrazi Sky Spawner was doing before right now. Score bottle time. Ah. Ooh. He knows what he did. That was as refreshing as I thought it would be. It's always as refreshing as you think it's going to be. What?! We would have drawn five cards. We'd be at five. Don't do it. Let me draw. Seriously? I bring it on myself, really. You know, like, it's no one's fault. I chose to squirt him with the squirt bottle. And, uh... Squirt bottle strats. <laughs> oh, dear God. Now, I think you just need to get another one for that. <laughs> that wasn't my fault. You squirted me, man. You know what you did, you stupid <laughs> Mitch. <laughs> we would have drawn five cards. They did have Incinerate in hand. Squirgle, I have come to burgle. Wow. Hamburglar, I've come to burgle. I was actually hoping for that, so now I can play. Oh, and Oran. Oran Viper all day. You remember that song from the 80s? Yeah. No, you don't. Shut up. Stupid. Wow. Got him. Pick my stip for the next... What was your... Did you send us? Did you do a stip? What's going on right now? Kyle, what's going on right now? Oh, congratulations. <laughs> Goblin Chain Wheeler, still a POS after all these years. So this guy, we're going to draw a card. I'm going to get a card. It's going to be a 4-4. Four, four. No, I'm going to draft right now. What does that mean? I don't understand what's happening right now, Kyle. You're being real weird. Oh, I think he wants you to give him a stip for his draft. Oh, pick my stip. Oh, somebody pick some elf, elf a-holes stipulation. Wow, really? They did have it. Look at that. I think we're dead. Both of these games... We could have won, but we instead we lost. Both of the determining matches of these of these games we lost. Anyone who says streaming God, Kiki Chiki and friggin' Chain Roller are pretty good, man. Thank you. I feel like I just pass. Not bounce anything? I mean, what do I bounce? This guy? Then it comes down again. It deals one to everything. This guy copies it. It deals one more. It kills Man of War. I could bounce this guy, I guess. Reforce them to play it. Destroy the child. Destroy the child. I can't believe... I thought we were still in combat, and I was like... 
Alright, I'll just gain the life now. Five cards we would have drawn. I mean, there's no guarantee we would have had an answer for those friggin' P and Kieran Lard dudes. And we were at, they did have an incinerate in hand, so we were technically at three. Or two, rather. But, still. Uh huh. Sometimes you just gotta destroy the child, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, man. No, I got you. I got you, fam. Where was that last turn? I think we're dead. Um, we're not dead yet. We might be dead. Yeah, this looks like an O2. Mike say destroy the child like Eeyore? You mean like the the thing from Money the Pooh? See, now we might be dead. <sighs> of course, I mean, if we can hit a six land, we could have played Drowner, I guess, but that would have been good, but one... Yeah, see, look, like this card? Pretty good. All right. Well, we are O2. We'll play it out cuz why not? Actually, I don't really remember how ER sounds, so it's going to be difficult for me to do that. I don't either. Get your tail back on properly, Eeyore. No matter. Most likely lose it again anyway. This tail, Kanga. Much nicer than the rest of me. It's not much of a tail, but I'm sort of attached to it. Not much of a house. Just right for not much of a donkey. Wow, you are so I sad. A day or two, but I'll find a new one. And uh, is you're like the saddest character in all of existence? My God. Destroy the child. Fushino Panic, don't even talk to me about GG's, you scumbag. <laughs> How dare you. Yeah, so I had Sphinx's Revan hand against you in game two when you, when you, put, me to, when you, when you put me to Exaxes. And I could have actually cast it for five in game five. Uh, but I was actually distracted because people wanted me to spray Mike with the, with the water bottle. So I did that. And I was like, yeah, let me spray him. All right, go to blocks. Oh, no, I died. And I actually took the damage, so... Um, kind of threw that game away. Wow. That's rude. Don't wish somebody good luck and then kill their bird with a, with a blossoming defense. A flame slash, you mean? Yes. <laughs> God. Oh boy. It has been zero days since Frank beatboxed. <laughs> I'm actually going to keep these. Because we can go forest into a tune and get, a, get another green for uh, Kodama. Kodama! Which should be pretty good. Dear God. Sword? Hmm. Spell Skite. They're just going to infinite us, right? They're just going to combo us out. See, I wish I could just get one waste here. Instead, we're going to go get a forest to play Kodama next turn. But it's not great. Yeah, it's Shroud. 
Yeah, but it's kind of dirtily because I feel like they're just going to kill us here. Like they have three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana. That's a lot. I Heart Surgeon, number one. He draining walked it. <sighs> of course he did. It's pretty good. Tell me more, Michael. Oh man, you, you, you could have bounced it. <laughs> you know, they redirect. But what if they didn't? Oh my, I'm having a good... We have no way to deal with flyers in the deck. That's the biggest problem, I think. Dramokers command. Got him. It's not bad. Yeah, this deck is a bit of a mess, I think. I don't see why there isn't a reason why you can put waste in your deck. Like, it's a literally a basic land. It's pretty dumb. On the bright side, like, our first round we probably could have won um, if we literally remembered that Drowner was in our deck, right? We literally win that match. We get Drowner. We tap down the two flowers. We attack for eight. Super easy to do. We knew they had nothing in hand. We basically win that game if we can just remember. If we had a way to see what's in our deck... Um, we probably could have, like, went to, uh, I don't even know where you'd go on the client. It's so confusing. Like, I would go to Freeform. Nope. Freeform. Nope. It's literally, there's nothing else here. Commander, Commander, more basic. Freeform Vanguard. Nope. Trade Binders. It's like not, there's no deck here. Um... Keep because of Ponder. I also, I'm not a big fan of Compulsion. It just takes too much mana to get going. Like, I never have two mana that I want to spend and a card that I really want to get rid of just to get a random card. Um, one land and then we're kind of locked into it like we're going to play this next turn into this and then draw this and then we're just drawing randomly after that yep I think that's fine we still have we actually have compulsion too so I think it's going to be a little too slow but I guess we'll find out White land or a black land would be great here. They're called Plains and Swamps. Caves of Quillos. Okay. What did we take Lightning Greaves over? Wasn't there like a kind of like a medi like three mediocre cards? I don't remember, man. Okay. Well, that's good. That was ages ago. <coughs> oh, that was a nice one. That's exactly what we want. Now we got Drogus Command. Everything in our hand just turned on with that one with that one draw. If your opponent's deck is better, trade decks. <laughs> I feel like that's a stipulation at least two people have to uh have to get behind. God, I'm just killing them with the selfish visionary. Boop, 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 How do they win? Boop, boop, boop. Did you say poop? I said boop. Take a little boop? Yeah, man. Take a little boop. <laughs> it was Greaves or Verdant Force? Yeah, I'm not sure Verdant Force would be better in the deck. There was one other card, wasn't there? I thought it was a three-way tie. Yeah, there was one other card. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's all I can do. I don't know if he's already dead. I think he's doing just fine. Oh, 
Tamio. We could pro our guy. If you win, it counts for me, and you should concede. Deal? Oh, wow. You're going to tap my forest? That's intriguing, because now I can almost kill Tamio. Well, no, I can kill Tamio. If I want to. You can kill Tamio if you want to. You can leave your friends. Good one. Nailed it. Tamio far behind. <laughs> Hot potato if you want to. You can do do skibbit do. Yabba dop dop skibbit bop bop. Gonna draw three right now. We can dance. We can dance. Everybody's touching their pants. <laughs> Don't make me. We can't make you. We can encourage you to. But we. <sighs> pew pew pew. That's a pretty good draw. It's okay. We can mana war it. Yeah. Actually, we can mana. We can mana war it. We can. Oh. Shut up. You like our snickleberries? Oh. What? Oh. What? What are you? The bells and lock? <laughs> Is that what it's called? What's that dude called? The bells and lock? That's the demon, isn't it? Yeah. What are you talking about, man? The the one from the office. The literal one that I thought you were doing. Oh, Bell Schnickel. Bell <laughs> That's it. Yeah, no, 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 no. The Bell Schnickel. I was doing a Rick and Morty meme. The, the really? Ser the cereal guy. Where the kids stab him open and take out the the cereal from his oh, testings. Oh, yeah, in the forest. Me lucky Schnickleberries. Oh, no. That's a cartoon, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. That's scary. Well, the whole thing's a cartoon, Frank. Got him. Did you? Did you get him? I did. Did you? What are you doing over there? What are you doing anywhere, you stupid nerd? I don't think we want that to happen. That's pretty bad for us. I mean, it doesn't put him pretty far off playing Inferno Titan, but... It puts us off from doing a lot of things, too, so... You like ever playing this game? Cryptic Command. That ain't it. Why would you do this? Don't do me like that. Don't do me like that. Go ahead. Come on. You want to do it. Oh, why have you done this? What? I was hey? making a meme reference. That's all. That's one meme reference you got there, buddy. You bell schnickel. <laughs> hey, now we can draw Cryptic Command and can't cast it. Oh, dang. We couldn't anyway because it's got a blue. Because it's got the blue. I hate you more than... Because you got the blue. More than words is the amount that I hate you today. See, I like this because they can only kill one. Yeah, great. <laughs> Fantastic. I'm probably just going to discard bird to this. Maybe I'll discard this to this. Maybe it's just discard everything. Now with the Petty, I have no idea what you're saying right now. Was it there was a Tom Petty song? I don't know what I'm doing with my life. Messing everything up. I think we want to hit Void Snare before they hit Void Slime before they hit their Inferno Titione. Slagstorm. Why are you not just playing Inferno Titan? I don't understand. Oh, we could have Jerokas commanded there. Dang, we're bad at this game. That's a good one. Little Drifter. Gosh, draw two cards? So broken, dude.
easy game. Easy life? It's hard to tell, you know. Inferno Tutans. Inferno Tutan. We have Cryptic Command in this deck, right? Yeah, we have Cryptic Command, Void Slime, and Circuit Logic. We have a bunch of counter spells. Well, he's certainly not playing his creature, so he's giving us all the time to draw it, which is nice. I mean, theoretically, we can Compulsion one more time, discard this, try to hit Void Slime. But, uh, you know. Inferno Tutan is what happens after Tacos. That's fair. That's fair. Another radio. This song will say, "Oh, you're the one I found." I was fine. You know that jam? Yeah, I know that jam. Yeah, I bet you do. Like everything was possible. My name's Mike B. Running down a dream. Never would come to me. Yeah, you can have that. A bar of soap. <laughs> oh, a little lighter spring, laddie. Okay, thing in my butt. You see that thing and shove it up your butt? Yeah, running down a dream. Never was come, never would death mystery. Now all your horses are dead. Wild horses couldn't drag me away. Oh my god. Hey, look, now we can play that guy. He's got Shroud. <laughs> he has Shroud. Four, five, six. One, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. We make two angels. Send me two angels. Oh. And we know they only have Infernal Titan and one of their card in hand, so that's pretty good. Just slam it. Or we can just tap out for a Sphinx's Rev here. And draw six. Yeah, could do that. How many wee babies does this make? I don't know. Four, five, six? You got in front of time. That doesn't seem that great. You're right. I'd much rather make the angels. I never would come to me. Getting on a mystery. My name is kind of Mike B. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anything was possible. How much do you pay? What are you willing to sacrifice? For life? Man, you really paying that? Are you really playing that card? Does not seem good, man. What does it make? Horrors? Black minions. <laughs> You're my black minion. <laughs> That actually sounds real bad. It uh, does not sound good, man. Black Minion? Jeez. That's dark. That sounds like something else, doesn't it? Black Minion? Yeah. It doesn't sound good. I don't know what you're insinuating, but either way, it's not good. It literally, it literally sounds like a, like a... I don't know. Just, just get out of the subject, man. It's, it's not, not good. good. Running down a dream. Gonna cat, gonna a uh, Kodama <laughs> of the tree. What? And demonetized. <laughs> oh, 
biscuits. But 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 biscuits. Buttered biscuits. Butter my biscuit. I think we're just actually tapping out for this right now. Sometimes when you draw, you're in time. <laughs> 20 years of black minions. Yeah, kind of like that. Story. Now you're getting it. Yeah. Six, seven, eight. Sorry, if I don't block this guy, I die, right? Uh, yeah. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Yeah, we're probably gonna just block him. God, Infernal Titan is a dude. <laughs> Did you like that? Infernal Titan is a dude. Well, that's not false. It's not untrue. You know that. Hey, I don't know. He could be female. Female? Mm -hmm. Famale? Mm -hmm. Hmm. I had not considered such things. Oh, do they just make a token and then... Oh, do we void slime their, making, their token makeage? Doesn't seem that good. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Dang it! Does it not seem good? How do we not die to Inferno Titan? We draw her of hope and then we tap it down. Okay. Then maybe we do counter it. Yeah, well, this guy's going to get chumped. Like, we just win with this next turn, right? Yeah, running down a dream. Never would come to me. Working on a mystery. I mean, we could also take three from his shooty and then block with one token and then kill him on the crackback. There's a lot of different... Uh... His one shooty. His one shooty. Of course, if they do have a counter spell for Dr. Owner, we die. So we might actually just want to wait and decree. What is their last card, man? What are the odds? What are the odds they have a counter spell? There's no way, bro. Never There's have it, bro. What, is that you? Are you over there? Is that you? Is that your little face? <laughs> God, what do we do? I want to pass. I'm going to keep up Dr. Owner. Oh, wow. We have four cards on our deck. We should probably be careful. Just don't mess it up, man. That's a dude. Did you like that? Yeah, it was good. I can tell you almost spit out your ice on the floor. Wouldn't do it the first time. Yeah, I know. I know. Doctor Owner MD. Working on a mystery. Cycling this decree. Got a million one ones. What do you do? Oh yeah. Only three cards in our deck. Watch they're gonna compulsive research us and kill us. It's going to be quite funny. That would be pretty epic. 100% counter spell GG no re. Yeah. Kind of like that. NA not close. Number one NA not close. Are you dead? You're not going to tell me, I see. Well, I understand. I guess we just alpha here, right? Mm-hmm. I guess I'll play this guy first to see what happens. Let me peep them crads. They're like, dang it, I'll just scoop. They did have a counter spell. Wow. That's amazing. Oh, 
I'm Dr. Owner. The spawns come out of my top. I'm Dr. Owner. <laughs> out, of my, out of my mouth they will pop. I'm <laughs> Dr. Owner. The drowsy so fun. <laughs> 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 yeah, right, man. Gene tap his dudes down and win. Oh, we win anyway. He goes block here, block here. He takes three. He's at two. They have two blockers against five attackers. Okay. You don't need to do. You don't need to be tricky here. <laughs> <laughs> what? Because <laughs> that song is so ridiculous. It's even worse when you go in the Mister Bucket to, to the to the Doctor Owner. Bucket. Buckets of fun. Last card of Tuna Thay there. It doesn't do very good there. Bulkins. <laughs> you doing all right, man? Crimson Acolyte seems great against. Uh, this has been good every match. All three of our rounds have been red dudes. Bulkins of fun. Buketos of fun. I think I'm just gonna scoop to this guy when uh, when we're in the in the moment. <laughs> the scions pop out of my top, I'm Mr. Bucket. I think I'm we keep this. I'm Doctor. I did keep it. It's already too late. I'm Doctor Owner. I got my PhD in ownerage. <laughs> what do we get here? A blue? It's gotta be a blue, right? Probably. 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 Our opponent is 01, right? I'm Dr. Owner. Owners of fun. What a nice boy. You talking to me? Uh-huh. X gonna give it to you. I'm gonna give it to you. X gonna give it to you. I'm feeling especially, uh... Destroy the child. Destroy the child. Destroy the child. <laughs> oh, this is a classic. This is a, this is a... Which one is it? Which blue guy that he draws a card do you want? The Rogums, because we can actually... Jermokas command this dummy. Let me ask you something, man. When was the last time you destroyed the child? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Not God. too long ago. I'm Dr. Owner. The spawns come out of my top. I'm Dr. Owner. <laughs> out, of my, out of my mouth they will pop. I'm <laughs> Dr. Owner. The drowsy's so fun. I'm Dr. Owner. Oh, well. All right. They miss land drops. So, uh... Oof. Oof. It's getting hot in the old town tonight. I want to take this Mole Drifter because that's the only thing they can cast.
Now I have the perfection jingle stuck in my head and I'm recalling a large amount of anxiety that game caused me as a child. Wait, what was the perfection? What was perfection? I don't even remember that. I don't know. I don't know. I, my name is Michael. I don't, you don't know either. <laughs> Shut up. I hate you. You understand? I'm going to play this guy. You ready for this beating? You. You! Uh. Crank Dad Soldier Boy. You! Remember that song? Shut up, man. Yeah, everyone remembers that song. I was saying, so I'm like, yeah, everybody remembers that, dude. No, that ain't, that ain't, no, nobody don't remember that. I'm Mr. Michael. Michael's a fun. Crank that soldier boy. I'm glad we stuck this out, man, because this, this game three was really, uh, I think it was a valuable experience for everybody. Yeah, no, totally. Yeah, no, totally. So long, friends. I hardly knew you. Should we just... Never mind. What, bro? Nothing, man. I'm gonna suspend this dude for one. Okay, have fun. Wait. Have fun and you like it. I'll hit you again. <laughs> <laughs> what is that from? <laughs> from nothing, I just made it up. It's real scary because you did it in a way that like I've never seen you do before. Like, that was a new bit for you, man. I've never seen you do that before. Do it again. Put the pieces into the slot. Make the right selection. Oh, I remember this. Oh, yeah, that game, that game, yeah. No, when that game would pop. <laughs> yeah, that was like Operation to me. That was I a game I was like, played that game. I'm not enjoying myself right now. I'm having a bad time. Like, that literally causes anxiety, dude. I agree with you completely about that. It's got a catchy song, though. Look at that. Look at all the things we're doing. It does have a catchy song. Put the pieces in the box. Make the right correction. But be quick, you're wasting the clock. Pop good perfection. This guy, no, this is lethal by itself. All right, you got it, Joseph M. Flynn. 88 Aeon Chronicler is going to do what he do. 10 play pizzles, ladies and gentlemen. Actually, that was dumb. Why did I give him the win? Actually, that's stupid because we get 40 if we go 2 1, right? It's not packs, it's play points. So I forgot that, I forgot. We just did a good deed for no, for nothing. We actually lost, and I don't even care. Whatever, it's whatever. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. really appreciate it. I'm not going anywhere if you're watching on Twitch. I'm just going to end the YouTube video. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on Twitch and Patreon. And uh, make me feel better about myself for giving away 30 play points for no reason when we could have just won the game. Smash the like. Smash the like. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks.